Good morning. This is Rush Hour, Rush Hour Bible Study Chat with Apostle Kim Muniz. Listen, I want you to remember what God has done for you. Remember what he's done for you so that you can put your confidence, your trust in the Lord. Remember the times past, how he's brought you out. Remember how he delivered you from destruction. Remember how he saved your soul. Remember when you cried out to him by reason of your affliction. Remember, hallelujah. Remember and trust in him. Listen, he's always with you. Matthew 28 and 20. Let's go to the word. Matthew 28 and 20. Teaching them to observe all things whatsoever I have commanded you. And lo, I am with you always, even until the end of the world. Amen. That's Jesus talking here. Red letter. He said he is with us always, even until the end of the world. That's a fact. That's a guarantee. That's a surety. He's with us always. Even when you think that God is not close, even when you think that he's not near, even when you think that he hasn't heard you, he's with you always, even until the end of the world. Hallelujah. Let's go to Psalm 62, Psalm 62 and eight, Psalm 62 and eight. Trust in him at all times, ye people, pour out your heart before him. God is a refuge for us, Selah. Trust in him. Put your confidence in him. Cast your cares upon him, everyone. Cast your cares upon him. He is your refuge. He is your refuge. God should be your refuge, your habitation, your all in all. Hallelujah. Let's go to Isaiah. I hope you're getting stirred up, stirred up to trust the Lord. Isaiah 43 and 1. But now thus saith the Lord that created thee, O Jacob, and he that formed thee, O Israel, fear not. I have redeemed thee. Hallelujah. I have called thee by name. Thou art mine. Listen, the Lord is claiming his children. He's not a deadbeat dad. He's not a deadbeat father. He claimed you. He called you. He formed you. He created you. Hallelujah. And he's telling you not to fear. He's got your back. He redeemed you. He said he, we are his. Hallelujah. Thou art mine. This is what Isaiah says in 43 and 1. So don't worry. Remember in times past, he brought you out. You're still here. You're still alive. You have breath in your body. Hallelujah. Have confidence in the Lord God Almighty. Hallelujah. Let's go to Exodus. One of my favorites. Exodus chapter 14 and verse 14. It says, the Lord shall fight for you. Hmm? The Lord shall fight for you and ye shall shall hold your peace. Listen, hold your peace while you're in transition. Hold your peace while you're waiting. Hold your peace while you're going through your processes. The Lord Almighty, the Lord strong in battle, the Lord is fighting for you. Hallelujah. And if God be for us, who can be against us? Jeremiah 29 and 11. That's one of our favorites. Hallelujah. It says, for I know the thoughts that I think towards you. God is not thinking bad about you. Hallelujah. He's not thinking evil thoughts against you. He says, I know the thoughts that I think towards you, saith the Lord, thoughts of peace and not of evil, to give you an expected end. Listen. God is always with you. He's always thinking of you. He's fighting for you. He knows your name. He is your refuge and he has big plans for you. Remember this. Remember how he did you in times past. He brought you out. You're still alive. 
You have breath in your body. Give him praise and trust him. Chao, bendiciones.